watched the G Freak J video the other day about his head was ready to explode over just some stupid shit. And one of the things he was twisted about was the fact that they want to put bands on large sodas, you know, large soft drinks. Right? Uh, you know, I hadn't really heard about this anywhere other than YouTube until tonight. And so I go to the ball game tonight, and my girlfriend and her oldest plays softball. So we get there, the kids are all running around playing. All the parents are sitting there talking and shit. My girlfriend's got a 52-ounce fucking drink. We're going to be there for a couple hours, right? This bitch. Oh, why you up? They're going to put a fucking ban on large soft drinks. That's one of the dumbest fucking things I've heard of in a while. I mean, who the fuck comes up with this bullshit? What fucking difference does it make to you if somebody else drinks... Two liters of fucking soft drinks a fucking day. It doesn't fucking matter. If you don't want to drink sugary fucking drinks, then don't fucking drink them. That goes for anything. Like that fucking town, Middleboro. Same fucking silly neurotic fucking shit. They want to start fucking finding people for cursing. You can't say that. You cannot curse. Or we're going to give you a $20 ticket. Well, I have to put my shit on layaway, man, because I'm going to say what the fuck I want. I don't give a fuck what town passes laws where you can't say that. And people vote these assholes into office and agree with them, and they pass these fucking laws. I mean, it's like people these days want to be told what to do. They want to be fucking controlled. They're so fucking codependent and so easily fucking brainwashed that they're just going to go along with this shit. Now they're telling you how much you can consume, how much you can fucking drink, what you can say? I mean, they've been doing this shit to us for fucking years. A buddy of mine the other day, we were talking about how easily people are brainwashed, right? Gas was down to about 326 the other day. I don't know, it's probably been a few weeks ago. And he's like, God damn, you see the gas prices? This is great. No, it's not great, dude. 326 for fucking gas? I mean, we've gotten used to it being almost four bucks a gallon for so long. Now, when it drops down to almost three, boy, you think you're getting a fucking good deal. They're still fucking you. They're still fucking you. We've just adjusted to getting fucked. At first, it hurt. But, hell, it almost feels good now, right? They're still going to fucking offer you a shit fucking deal on gas. But yet, you think, well, it's not as bad as it was last week. Now, of course, that only lasted for a few days, and it went right fucking back up. You know, if we're going to ban shit... Why don't we just ban mindless dick suckers? I'm sick of fucking mindless cocksuckers, aren't you?